Thank you. So it is 12.40 p.m. I had to wait for my mother to finish up all the things she was doing. Which surprisingly was very little, but still took a lot of time. So yeah, here we here we are again, back here. Currently uploading part fourteen. I'll up, upload fifteen after that. This may be the last video, or it may not be. I don't know, because my controller is going out now. How do we get that? How do we get that? Does this have to move? You didn't hurt your back, did you? I did not hurt my back. Through these doors. Wait, so did the giants or the elves build Tears Temple? All the races helped with its construction. It was the last great act of cooperation between the realms before peace disappeared for good. Leosta. Your bowstring stopped glowing. Its power is now depleted. Only a few knocks of magic remained in the bowstring, and we used them. Your bow, please. Once you claim the light of all time, infuse the bowstring with its power. Don't forget. You talk like you're not coming with us. I'll try, but measures were taken to keep me trapped in Midgard. Why? The gods don't care for me much. Is this it? It's so dark. This temple has been asleep, underwater for almost 150 winters. It needs only the light of the Bifrost to reawaken. Those roots don't look like your magic. They aren't. About what she said about the gods not caring much. Well, they seem to care enough to keep her trapped in Midgard. These roots are part of the great world tree and make travel between the realms possible. Approach the table. How does it work? You will need this. A Bifrost, to create travel between realms. It can capture, hold, and transfer the light of Alfheim. Place the Bifrost there. What now? Give it a moment. The temple needs time to wake up from its long slumber. It is from this room, and this room alone, that you will be able to cross between realms. What you see before you represents the temple in which we stand, as well as the realm towers that encircle the Lake of Nine outside. All the realms exist in the same physical space, reflections of each other. These doors, the towers outside, and the Nine Realms are all intertwined and coexisting on the branches of the World Tree, separated only by the Bifrost Light of Alfheim. 
This place can focus and control that light. And is this the World Tree? Only an artistic representation of it. No, the Yggdrasil is much, much more than this. The Tree of Life is bound to the fate of the world, just as we are bound to it. The tree nourishes our soils. The dew from its leaves feeds our valleys and rivers. The tree's very existence supports all of creation along its boughs. It's life energy interwoven into the tapestry of life. Birth, growth, death, and rebirth. Every strand transcending time, transcending space. Everything comes back to the tree. So, that's how it works. But I'm guessing you were looking for a more practical answer. Yes. Very well. The bridge you pushed outside is currently positioned to lead to the realm of Vanaheim. Instead, turn the wheel to our actual destination, Alfheim. Vanaheim. Realm unavailable. Odin has prevented access to this realm. The travel rune will never work. You must select the destination realm, Alfheim. I know. Wait, is this moving the big bridge outside? Yes. The wheel turns the bridge, and the bridge aligns to the different realm towers on the lake outside. Wait, there's no tower on this one. And that's why realm travel to Jotunheim is impossible. Without a tower for the bridge to lock into, the sequence can't begin. Realm unavailable. Missing realm tower to access this realm. Every realm has a travel rune that unlocks the bridge to that realm. I'm giving you the one for Alfheim. Now you can lock in your destination. Okay. We're ready. Remember to take the Bifrost. You don't want to lose that. Now the realm travel bridge will align, and the realm between realms will open. See that giant crystal? Each realm has a corresponding one that focuses and amplifies the power of the Bifrost, opening the bridge to that realm. That's why realm travel is only possible from this room. What about that one realm tower missing from the lake? The Jotunheim Tower disappeared from all realms over a hundred winters ago, when the giants vanished from Midgard. Where the tower went and how they moved it remain a mystery. A realm beyond complete. Here. Follow me. The Bifrost is dark. This trip was its last use. There's no going back until it's replenished with the light of Alfheim. So we are trapped. Someone of your ability should have little trouble getting back to Midgard. And we'll be able to make that black bread go away? With the captured light of Alfheim, yes. The wish will show us how to travel to Alfheim to seek the pure light. That's my dog right now. The black breath. Some sort of nasty smelling magic stopped us as the entrance to the mountain. Uh, at. At. Sorry. At the entrance to the mountain. Uh. Friendly witch from the woods appeared and told us we need the light of Alfheim, and she's going to help us get it. Yeah. Ugh. 
Oh, hoo hoo! Welcome to Alfheim, gentlemen. Think you can spot the light? I can barely see it. Something's wrong. See that column of light on the horizon? It's housed in the heart of a ring temple. We'll find what we need there. No. Oh. No, no, no. Damn it, not yet. What's happening? <sighs> to restore the Bifrost magic, you must step into the light. But be very careful not to get your body. Hmm. She's not dead. Is she? No. Not likely. Come. Tears Bridge. Place. Stay by me. Touch nothing. She's probably not coming back, is she? Okay. What is that? A thing, child. A thing. Is there something glowing inside that knot? Yes. There it is. It's gone now. Killed it. Look up there. Okay, it's probably just some random creature. Uh -oh. Whoa, what's that about? Not our concern, boy. Focus. Well, it's going to be our concern very soon. A lot of corpses here. Let me grab this. Look here. What does it say? Hmm. Something about an eternal war for the light. I don't get it. Both sides need it. Why not just share it? Greed. You will find it a common cause for war. Yeah. The Light of Alfheim. Capture the light of Alfheim and dispel the black breath to reach the mountain. Find the way to the light. We actually traveled to Alfheim, a whole other realm. But the witch vanished. I hope she's okay. Now we have to find the light that lets us fill the Bifrost so we can get back to Midgard and use it against the black breath. Yeah. All right. The Eternal War. The Eternal War for the light endures. The same light we need for the Bifrost, of course. Now, let's, uh... <sighs> Darn it!
They keep murdering the White Elves. It is war. The end of one. The robed ones lost. Oh. Mm-hmm. And now we must deal with them. You have to do, boy. Where? Exactly. Ugh. Where's this stuff even come from? Something, boy. I need to heal. Yes, I need to heal. There. Did you say something? No. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. At least we're getting closer to the light. Yeah. Yeah, we are. Sindri? Compass area markers. When a compass turns gold, an objective is somewhere in the area. Search the area for clues. Light of Alfheim. There. First, we are going to go talk to him. How are you here before us, dwarf? We were told our path was the only one between realms. Well, it may be the only way for you to travel, but we dwarves are full of surprises. That is not an answer. Hang on to that sense of wonder. There's so little mystery once you've amassed the wealth of arcane knowledge that I have. <laughs> Where to comb the realms for exotic resources. How to craft them into creations that defy imagination. To the novice, I'm sure it all seems like magic. But... Uh, oh, all right. It's magic. 
Are you happy now? Sindri, have you always been so... Clean? Huh. Don't I wish. <laughs> no, I was just as unsanitary as the next dwarf until the day a Vanir witch set me straight. She discovered with her magic there are hundreds of thousands of tiny beasties on everything around us. Ugh, so small you can't even see them. No. It's true. And if they get inside you, they make you sick. But the witch told me there's one wood, the oak, that's a natural deterrent. Stops the beasties from spreading. So now, I make all my handles from oak. See? I think of these things. <laughs> okay, back to work. So how come Brock's blue and you're not? Boy. <laughs> oh, it's fine. Very good question, actually. You see, my brother's not as careful as I am. In fact, he prefers to work with metals using oh, his own bare hands. Ugh. No gloves. Says it's the only way he can hear what it wants to be. Touch enough raw silver and it changes your skin irreparably. Uh. forever. I wouldn't bring it up to him, though. <laughs> You know how sensitive people be. I guess that makes sense. Sindri, why don't you just make up with your brother already? Me? Make up with him? Because he's an obstinate pighead incapable of change. Because he says the most terrible things about me. Just because he's insecure about his own work. Which, let me tell you, is subpar. Because he blames me for... For the things that aren't my fault. Huh? Like what? Would you pardon me, please? I need to collect myself. No. What speaks to you? <sighs> Probably shouldn't let my brother lay there. hands on it again. But if he does, tell him to temper his steel longer. He's warping the bit work. Upgrade of the vise and act successful. Viking tunic. Get more vitality. Viking, Viking. I do want more health. I think that's a key for Yeah, we'll go for that. Well, I can't get this stuff now. Upgraded. Who knew? Upgrade again, but let's upgrade the uh, chest armor. Knapsack. 
not done with the masks yet, so that's gotta wait. Come back anytime. Yeah, I'll be right back on this video real quick. <laughs> 